Well, there you go. There is a fireworks rocket that we built in less than five minutes of time with 220 pieces. Um, you know, if you want to guys want to play along, make sure to click the link, the affiliate link down below, and you can go and order up this $15 kit um, on Amazon or get it at Target or Walmart or whatever, and you guys can play along. Uh, I'd love to see what you guys make, you know, that would be great. And don't forget to subscribe. We release a new video each and every day. It's Make Sure Daily, so it's every single day. We have a new video um, of Lego builds or any other builds, actually. So there you go. Uh, that is a fireworks rocket. Let's check out how I built this. So did you guys hear fireworks? Let's put fireworks... Uh, into Lego form and find out how we can build some firework maybe rockets is what I'm thinking uh, So let's put five minutes on the clock And build some fireworks. So yeah, I think it's gonna be rockets right something like a rocket um, That we can Maybe something like this Maybe this is gonna be simple. I thought it might be a little difficult, but uh we already got a rocket. <laughs> uh, how are we going to build out a little bit more? Maybe something like that. Mm, two stage kind of deal. Like that maybe. Or maybe No, I don't like that. So how are we going to put wings on the side though? Let's see, how can we do that? Maybe something with these colors. And then use this here. Change the color, change the scheme, then some fins maybe like that oh I like that I'm liking that a lot so something like this that's a cool rocket so boom shoo, right Need to zoom in a little here. Okay, so there we go. So there we got a rocket here. We're two minutes in though, so let's see what we can do to make, you know, maybe um, sparkles in the sky, right? Maybe this is the after effect of the of the of the fireworks itself, right? Maybe it's a rocket that then explodes, right? Let's get some of the dots here. So maybe, maybe something like this, where it's got the innermost part that's like a sizzle. And then the outer, the mid, the mid, the middle ring is pink. And then the most sizzle part is like that. And it kind of is mushrooming. No, I don't like that at all. It just looks like dots on uh, blue. Don't like that. That's hard to do. I thought it would I thought it would turn out somewhat correctly, but I don't like that at all. So maybe we put some some flame on the bottom of the firework here. The rocket. What do you guys think? Something like that. Or maybe 
like that and then this Ooh, this looks good this looks promising do we do that or do we do more i think we do more that's cool i like that effect you know so it's got that it's got the engine down there maybe we we'll make this longer oh oh maybe we we'll make the body of the rocket longer what do you guys think um we got two more here so let's see what that looks like is it out of proportion is it in proportion does it look better this length or shorter what do you guys think I like that. I think that looks good. Let's try one out of the middle here. Yeah, that looks good. So we got five minutes are up. So we tried to do the, the sparkle uh, effect of the fireworks, but that didn't turn out really well. So I like the look of this, this overall rocket. It's got the flames coming out the bottom it's got yellow transitioned into red um, for the flame structure so it looks like it's got some motion in it and it's about to just take right off and it's got the side fins um, I don't think I would have added four of them I like the way this looks um, and then it's got this Long part where all the fireworks are going to be stored at, and it's got the cone to uh, to pop off when uh, when the fireworks when the rocket gets to the top, and the fireworks need to explode into a million little pieces that are going to catch on fire and give that sparkle effect. So that rocket looks pretty cool. Um, so there we go. So we built some fireworks. If you think this looks like fireworks, leave a comment down below. If you think that we could have done something better with the amount of pieces that we have, leave a comment down below. And if you have a technique that you um, you can share with us that can make this better, love to hear it, love to see it. Also, uh, if you're going to go ahead and build fireworks or f rockets, you know, leave a take a picture and leave it on our social medias. There's links down below. We'd love to see what the community is building, uh, especially after we build something like this. So go ahead, build it, make it, destroy it, whatever you can do. And then uh, let's see what you make. Okay, let's go check out what we're going to build tomorrow. Hmm. Well, that was a cool build. So now we're leaving New Year's and we're traveling into January. And what do I think of when I think of January? Snow and ice, right? So the snow and ice season that is January and February. So I've put a whole bunch of themed items on the board that we're going to spin to find out what we're going to build in the next couple weeks. So we're going to start off today and we're going to spin the wheel, the maker wheel, and find out what we're going to build first for January. So it's an igloo. So that's really cool. So an igloo, maybe I got to find a way to, you know, sculpt the top in a ball, ball type fashion. But then it's got that short uh, tunnel in the front. So I got to make sure that I incorporate that as well. And don't forget, we're doing a giveaway contest for each of our YouTube milestones. So we're hitting 50. We're going to hit 100. We're going to hit 500. And when we hit 1,000, we're actually going to give away a brand new Ultimate Collector's X-Wing. So go check out the video and find out what you need to do in order to enter to win.